the day before it delayed as dev claims it doesn't have name trademark. Are you excited about the upcoming Survivor Aura game the day before? Well, hold on to your seats because unfortunately there are reasons to doubt whether the game even exists. Don't worry, I will explain everything to you but first make sure you subscribe to my channel, leave a like and comment something down below. Guys, the day before was supposed to be a third person survivor horror MMO with elements of gunplay, crafting and realistic vehicular traversal. It was one of the most highly anticipated game on Steam, but just days ago the game mysteriously fell off the platform with the developer Fantastic citing a trademark issue. Guys, according to the studio, they were unaware that someone else had trademarked the name of the game. And they made this announce via statement on Twitter in which they stated that it was Steam that blocked their game page at the request of a private individual. This private individual had allegedly filed a trademark application for the name the day before in the US before Fantastic did. Guys, if you actually look further into it, the trademark holder did not make the filing until May. And that is 5 months after Fantastic announced the game, making these allegations kinda sus. As a result of this issue, the day before's release date has been pushed back from March 1, 2023 to November 10, 2023. The reason for this delay is unclear and the legitimacy of the reasons is also being questioned. And guys, this is just the latest twist in a bizarre tale for the day before. The studio has previously been criticized for simply using volunteers to make the game and for including assets ripped off from other games in previous trailers. And guys, what impressed me the most is that despite all these issues, the day before has been one of the Steam's most wishlisted games for the better part of the year. And because all this, fans are skeptical of this excuse with some accusing Fantastic of taking down the game's trailer and screenshots before making the story list in private. Guys, there is mountain evidence that the day before might not even be a real game. And the day before's lead Discord mod has even begun to question the game existence, confirming that nobody on the mod team has seen actual gameplay. Fantastic has released a few gameplay trailers, but they have always been pre-recorded. Guys, there is no demo, no actual gameplay, nobody that has seen the game in action, and nothing other than fantastic word that the game even exists. I don't know about you, but I don't believe in this game. And fantastic has already proven that they cannot be trusted. And this actually makes me really, really sad. Because this game was expected by a lot of people. And, you know, we have this situation. I don't know, I don't know what to say. Well... See you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Leave a like. Comment something down below. Peace.